guys if you're not using gitx till now then you're really missing it and you should start using it right now after watching this video it's not for professional developers it's for everyone everyone can use it whether you're beginner or advanced and it makes you more productive and your code will perform way better than the old flatter way and also it will give you a better organized looking code and if you're planning to apply somewhere or work in an organization with a team the first thing they will ask you whether you know some dependency management like gitx provider or blog if you know that then your chance will be higher to get accepted and shortlist it so without talking too much let's get started with the gitx in this video and see how we can implement the navigation or routing from one screen to another and then in the coming videos i will show you some advanced topics like interacting with api or updating the locations and much more things to come on but before that i want you to like the video and subscribe to the channel so you won't miss such videos in the future and now let's get started all right so the first thing you do is copy the gitx into your pubspeak yaml and now we have got two screen into our application we will navigate from one screen to another screen using the old flutter method and using the getx in different ways so we've got the app running here and by pressing this button nothing happens for now and we want to implement navigating from this screen to the second page and let's see how we can do that by using old flutter method all right so we can navigate from one screen to another screen using flutter by using navigator.offcontext.push and it will take us to the second screen now if we press this button we will go to second screen and we can come back we also have another button here which we can come back to the previous screen by pressing that so to come back we can simply say navigator.offcontext.pop which will by pressing that it will do the same thing to come to the previous screen now let's do the same thing using gitx and see what are the changes the first thing if you want to use gitx into your application first thing you have to do is change the material app into git material app and that's it now down below inside your application you can use gitx in any screen anywhere you don't have to worry about importing or changing something so here the alternative for push is 2 we can simply say get dot to the second page and it will take us to the second page now if i comment this one and save it we actually have to restart because we have changed something here now if i check and press this button it will do the same thing going to the second page and come back how we can come back using the getx we can simply say get dot back which makes more sense now if i save it and i can press this button to come back to the home page now another method is to push to the second screen and uh, do not allow user to come back to the previous screen we can do that using flutter by all right now we can go to the second screen and we can remove the current screen we cannot come back to this screen again if i press this button and there's no back button here and if i change it to navigator.pop again by pressing this button we will get this blank screen because there's no previous context available that's why we are just popping the current screen which after that we don't have anything now to do the same thing using the getx we can simply say get.off it means push and remove until and in the second screen we can also change it to get.back let's see the result now we're trying the same thing using getx let's see how it looks so we are in the second screen and we don't have the back button and if we force to go back to the previous screen by using getx we will not get that black screen and this is the one advantage of getx which will control or handle your screens properly if you don't have context it will simply do nothing now the third method is to push into a named a specific named route we can do that using flutter by first we have to come and change this to material to show it in the flutter and also initial route we have to specify the current route and also we can also say in the routes we specify if it is the slash it means our main page or home page then we return the my app and if it is second we will go to the second page to use that down here we can simply say navigator dot push named we can simply pass the name that we have specified up here also here we have to change it to navigator dot off pop now if we restart the application we will get some error because we have not removed the default home from here once we have our default route we don't need the home now if we restart the application we can simply go to the next page using the specified name that we have specified here and we can also come back so to do the same thing using getx first thing we have to do is change the material app to get material app instead of routes we have got the get pages and the get pages is uh, a list of get pages widget which will have some more items now we can remove this thing which is for material app inside here we have got some more things like you can specify a lot 
lot of things here one of the important thing is this middleware and also you can do the transition let's see the example of transition we can simply say transition dot left to right now down here also we can do the same thing in the get x get dot to named we can simply say to named and pass the second here also in the second page we have to change this one to this one now if i restart the application and check the result now if i press this button it also does the transition from left to right which you have seen right there if I come back, it will be from right to left again. So these are the basic methods of navigating from one screen to another screen using Flutter and how to do that using GetX. Of course, in the coming videos, I will do some advanced topics using GetX. So be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. And thank you for watching. I will see you in the next video.